For those of you that love coffee, Monday was a great day. It was National Coffee Day. Many of you on Facebook and Twitter shared photos of your favorite caffeinated drink. Some businesses offered a free cup of joe just for this occasion. Moving along to our second topic, Chelsea Clinton welcomed a baby girl last Friday. She and her husband named her Charlotte. Former President Bill Clinton and former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton said they feel blessed, grateful, and happy to be the grandparents of a beautiful girl. Another thing that has many of you rejoicing is the release of Windows 10. So far, the reviews are positive. When releasing the software, the company stressed the fact that Windows 10 is more than just a small upgrade. It's a major overhaul. Earlier in the week, Olympic swimmer Michael Phelps was arrested for a DUI in Maryland. Apparently, his blood alcohol content was nearly twice the legal limit. As a punishment, some are saying he shouldn't be allowed to participate in the 2016 Rio Summer Olympic Games. Lastly, health officials are keeping a close eye on the developing situation in Texas after a man was diagnosed with Ebola. This is the first case diagnosed in the U.S. They're monitoring as many as 100 people that may have come into contact with the man. That's what was trending this week on the web and social media. Join me next week for another edition of Now Trending with Phyllis Smith. Reporting for 5 News, I'm Phyllis Smith.